Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's Black Ops Cold War video. Guys, the other day, over the weekend, actually, we got the Milano Gold. So where's that? Where's my Milano at? Oh, I don't have the Milano on here. I'll just make a quick look at this. Got the Milano Gold. Got her taken care of. It, um, I'm going to be honest with you. The these point blank challenges, which let me, let me go to the AK-74U, which is what I'm on now. And that's exactly what I'm on is the point blanks. The real pain, but I want to tell you guys for all of you out there who were like me and you had a hard time with flora Flora camos are so easy now. It's super duper easy So you're gonna to want to copy this class right here with whatever gun you're using basically double stun uh, Run tack mask instead of flag jacket just because so you can protect yourself from your own stun grenades And then gearhead is an absolute must with field mic and then you want to run these score streaks uav counter uav armor well, the armor is not necessary. The armor is necessary for point blanks, though. But I found that actually Jammer and Counter UAV both count towards it. The other day during my Milano video, I didn't get any to count. But I also am pretty sure like the last two weeks, the cameras have just been bugged. Because on the this AK-74 during yesterday's stream, I started yesterday's stream off. The AK-74 was at level 30 or 29, right? Because you need to be level 30 for these long shots. So it was level 29 at the beginning of the stream, and then three hours later, I had completed all my long shots and all my floras in one stream. Like, just playing, like, normally, I got it from 29 to 30 for uh, geometric, did my long shots, then I got to level 40, and then I got my 75 kills all during stream, and then now I've been working on my point blanks. Now, I know a lot of people like to use hardcore. Hardcore is probably really good for the ARs, but hardcore, I have found, is not that great for SMGs, just because the ARs will smoke you. Now, Point Blake though, is what I'm currently working on, and it is by far the hardest camo. So that's why I run on my Point Blank class. I have Smoke Grenades, I have Jammer, and I, I just put on Forward Intel. I'm not actually sure if it's that great or not. I'm trying to, I'm actually testing it. But what's super important is Smoke Grenades, Jammer, Ninja, Ghost, and Armor. Because if you have all those on, you have the most, like, sneaky sneaky, I guess, like, chance to like come up behind someone and just get a point blank kill now another thing i must say i found this out yesterday the easiest the absolute easiest way to get camos in this game to get if you want diamond fast like you want diamond now is to play with a, a party of six i mean even if your friends aren't good i mean we played with a party of six we're all pretty good so it was very easy but i'm sure that even if you played with like six people who are just like having fun i guess i mean it's like you're not you know like they're not necessarily the best it's still way easier to do with a party of six because i mean look first of all when you're in a party of six you don't join games like, like i just did let me throw a smoke here and see if i can no i was trying to bait him out but he shot me like through the smoke but if you're in a party of six first of all you don't join the games late like i did now i know it's barely late but i joined in and we are already being two capped so this is super annoying oh speaking of this being two capped I have officially 100,000% given up on the 5 win loss ratio. I'm not doing, I don't care. I wanted a 5 win loss ratio by the end of the year. That's not happening because I play solo sometimes for these videos. And I'm like, there's a 90% chance I rage quit this game because I joined in. We're getting two capped. And unless I can break out of this spawn trap right now, I'm probably going to rage quit. I mean, it's just simply not fair to that I have to join a game where I'm getting. Oh, another thing, the best thing for point blanks, which this sucks is you have to be level 50. But if you get the speed grip on your gun, which once again, you have to be level 50, which really sucks. But if you don't have your point blanks done yet and your gun's level 50, putting that speed grip on actually helps a ton because you run faster. Like, with your gun out, you run faster with your gun out than you would if you were running a combat knife. So, I'm rage quit. I'm not doing it. I'm not playing this two-cap game. I mean, you see what I'm saying, though? You can't expect me. Like, I joined that last game. Sure, it was, like, right away. But, literally, I joined being two-capped. Like, being spawn-trapped. Like, what, what am I supposed to do? Now, at least in this game, games like this, now I might get two-capped. I don't rage quit here. I, I mean, I, I really hardly... If I don't think I've actually ever rage quit a game where I joined in the beginning of, even when we get smacked around, because when I know I'm going for camos, I'm just like, you know what? It's fine. Like if I lose, because in all honesty, it just lowers your skill base, which is nice. No, why did you turn left? Why didn't you just follow your friend? I was going for the free, easy, double point blank. Do the point blanks are the hardest, like by far. And then when you hit level 50, you have to do the double kills, which is like the easiest one of everything, besides obviously just standard eliminations. Gone you don't you try to oh, i ran out of ammo oh my goodness i'm alive i'm al now some people might say that um stim shots are better than smoke grenades here but i like the smoke grenades uh, because it takes away everyone's aim assist and i can like with my ninja i just run right through the smoke and just honestly hope for the best now that guy what what a jerk 
Now, for point blanks, I think you have to be absolutely cracked out of your mind to actually get them. Right now, I am absolutely not cracked out of my mind. I did drink my G Fuel this morning, but this is just during my lunch break for work. So I'm just like trying to get my game in real quick, trying to get my video recorded. But if you can get absolutely cracked, like you can just, I mean, you can be ready to just play. Dude, I suck. I suck right there. Um, see what I'm saying? I'm not cracked. You gotta be cracked because here's the thing the best way, the reason why I'm on domination, I found so. I thought that uh, hardpoint would be the best. The problem I'm having with hardpoint is for point blanks and all that stuff, like camos basically, is hardpoint. Until we get a league play, hardpoint seems to be the game mode where like the tryhards go to, which is fine. Um, but I just want to be able to spawn trap. You know, in hardpoint you can't really spawn trap. I mean, you can, but like literally, even if you do it perfectly, which is rare, it's gonna last for like 60 seconds until the next hill. Where in Dom. You know, even if it's not every single game, but, like, if you just get that one good game where your team, especially, like I said, if you play with a team of six, you get that one good game where your team is spawn trapping them, and you can just sit in their spawn and just mow them down, that has to come, right? I don't know. Am I going to get the medal for that point blank? Probably not. That's another thing. I found a lot of times I don't even get the medal for the point blank, but after the game, I check, and my camo does go up. So, who knows? Oh, here we go. This is free. See, now, if I had the speed grip, this would be even easier, to be honest. That... See, look right there. Neither one of those camos pull up. I'm 99% sure both of those counted. Oh, look right there. I got double and hunter. But I'm, once again, I'm pretty sure both of those counted. Oh, here we go. What did I just get? Oh, five kills without. That's not what I wanted. It's definitely different. I don't know. But the speed grip makes it way easier because I can. The worst part is when you're trying to run behind someone and you cannot run them. And I have the Sigma on my back so I can shoot down spy planes. Big shout out to Panda Watch this. So if I have the armor, I've, Panda taught me that if you pop armor and then you immediately change weapons like that. Look, look in the bottom left. My, my armor fully equipped and I didn't have to go through the full animation. So shout out to Panda for that. Uh, now, the armor, obviously, as you can tell, it goes away most of the time in just one go. However, armor is really nice, like, for that, you know, even if you only get one point blank out of it, it's nice. So, why is it? And the other thing is, I don't really like running an attack helicopter when I'm going for camos, simply because I don't want my attack helicopter to take my kills. With, you know, I I'm trying to get my camos done as quick as I can, and if my own attack helicopter is taking my kills, and also... My attack helicopter gets a lot of kills. This raises my skill base, which I don't want. I want that skill base to be nice and low. And what I found is even when you're playing solo, if your friends aren't online, you can, if you just play like five games of going for point blanks and you do really bad, then on that sixth game, you are going to get a nice, easy lobby where you get like, I mean, I think my max is like, I got, ah, dude, I don't know the number. I know I have for sure gotten a game multiple games where i've had 10 like point blanks in one game now that's a lot for this camo now, i know most people will say that the easiest way to get point blanks is sit in a corner wait for someone to come to you what i found to be easiest is just to like like i was saying earlier spawn trap the enemy team which i'm doing a bad job of once again, i'm playing solo guys i'm telling you right now point blanks are so easy when you just have a group of six if like for real is dumb how easy it is so you just want to get your group of six, spawn trap the enemies, and then just flank behind them and spawn. What, you think you're going to kill me? I got that hit, so I'm going to give me, I'm going to give me elimination for that one. <laughs> so, yeah, for real, though, now the sitting in a corner, it can work. Now, it works a lot easier in, you know, hardcore, so you can actually one-shot the guy. However, I have a hard time playing hardcore, like I said earlier, with SMGs, just because the ARs are just so good in hardcore, you know? So, good on them. Give me that point blank. Now, that's a point blank, baby. Right there. That was a point blank. This is it right here. This is the sweet spot. Now, obviously, when you're in a spot like this, the enemy team knows exactly where you're at, especially like when you kill them in their own spawn. But right here is what we want. This guy, who's not... Oh, don't slide on... I found out. Don't slide on those guys. Uh, even if you're any ninja, they can hear you when you slide on them like that. So this guy right here, we just hope our, none of our teammates kill him. And then we just get this nice free... That's a free point blank right there. Here's where we do this nice little armor trick. We're... Oh, no. We're spawning on C. No. We're spawning on C. This is terrible. Dang it. That's another big reason why you need a party of six. Is like, so last night when we were playing on stream, spawns don't flip when you're playing with your friends because you can just ask... Oh, no. I'm out of ammo. But you can ask your friends to sit in the back of the map with, like, snipers or ARs. I actually kind of want you to kill me, but where's the... Is there not an ammo box on this map? Where's... I need an ammo box. Hello? Where... Is there, like, an ammo resupply that I can use? I I don't actually think... Wait, is this the only map where there's not an ammo resupply at? 
Where's the ammo resupply? This is my favorite spot to get people. Jump up right, right, right from here and just get whoever's head glitch on this rock. Easy, easy point blank. And then these guys up top, sure that guy just saw me, but if you just throw a smoke up there, they lose you. I mean, they're they're more worried about getting to their like little head glitch spot. So now another thing like that's fun when you have a party of six and you know spawns aren't gonna flip is you just touch the their zone where these guys both AFK. Oh yes, no, he's protecting them. No, I wanted that would have been two free point blanks, which is a lot. Like two free point blanks is a lot. Like that's how hard these things are. I have to get 75. I'm back here again. I'm trying to find the AFK guys. I might have found one. Yes, yes. Yes, I'm at 15. What was I at 10 before like before this video started? So I only have five point blanks through this whole game. So that first what was it called? That first round when I was like, I'm pretty sure that those count, even though I didn't uh get the medal. Looks like they didn't count because didn't I have more than that? I don't actually know. The I, I have found what has made this game a far less stressful is once it first of all, I gave up on my dream of the five one loss ratio. That's just not gonna happen when I'm grinding for camos, unless you're playing with a party of six the entire time. And then also I've given up on actually just trying, like keeping track of how many I got each game, which I still kind of do deep down, but I try to give up on just actually keeping track. And I just like, just wait for the camos to pop up. Oh no, no, no. Right there, that's the worst is when your teammate takes your kill. This guy though is really bad. So this is a free kill. Un unfortunately, if he shot me, if he didn't shoot me, I would've got a little bit closer to try to get that point blank. Oh, here we go. Is this him again? Zero two. No, the game ended. So, unfortunately, I went 37 and 15. Uh, and the reason why I say unfortunately is because I only got like five point blanks that game, I think. And now my skill based matchmaking is going to go up because, I mean, 37 and 15. So, next game's going to be hard again. But you know, it is what it is. You just got to, I'm just going to play back to back. Just go bad. Just keep going for my point blanks because as soon as the point blanks are done, your gun's basically gold. But thank you guys for watching today's video. That is how to get your SMGs diamond quickly. Thank you guys for stopping by. Oh, by the way, True Pop won the G Fuel Starter Kit giveaway this weekend. Yesterday on stream, we gave it away. True Pop was the one who won. He already came and claimed the prize. Also, don't forget, join the Discord because this coming Saturday, the 28th, we have a 4v4 tournament, $200 on the line. We have a lot more teams signing up now. So thank you guys for everyone who has signed up. If you haven't signed up yet, get your friends. It doesn't cost any money to get in. It's literally free to play in. So if you lose, who cares? It's double elimination. It's 4v4. If your team wins, you get $200. So $50 per person. That's a free $50 you would not have had normally. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you're not already. I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye.